To be good at anything, you must train and start early. You must challenge yourself each day to learn new and innovative things. Today, I'd like to introduce you to a new challenge that we're doing on the Stock Planner channel to improve your swing trading, to improve your consistency and your profitability. Before we get started, I want to tell you that we are an education channel and we do our own due diligence and try to learn and share and win. And before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe and ring that bell so you don't miss any information on this challenge. Let's get started right now. And this is the first for the Stock Planner channel. We're issuing a challenge. The challenge is with the hopes that, you know, sharing some ideas, getting everybody to engage will help everybody, including myself, improve their trading. So the challenge is how to beat the stock market in 2022. This is a swing trading challenge, but you can use any trading style and everybody can join. It doesn't matter where you're at in life, beginner or expert. The basic thing is we want to see if we can increase our account, either a paper trading account or a spreadsheet or even just write it on a piece of paper. From a starting point of one March to an end point of 30 June, to see if our account can increase by 3 to 6%. Well, that's three month period, that's one quarter, three times four is 12, that'd be a 12% APR. That's darn good. Or 24% APR, and that's beating Warren Buffett. I would challenge everybody right now to look back at their account, either a paper trading account or their actual account, three months ago, note the, the amount, and see if it increased by 3% over the last three-month period. Go back a year and take a three-month period. Very few people do it. Now, you read about and see on Wall Street bets on how everybody's making thousands of dollars or you how you can make $500 a day on a $100 account. It's, it's just not possible. Swing trading for me is looking at the market three to four months out. I do a lot of trades at 60 days, calendar days, or 45 trading days. I look at the market a longer term, but not necessarily in five to 10 years, although I do have a strategic view on when I do pick stocks. I look to see if they'll do well in the decade. The point of this challenge is to make you more consistent and you do that by engaging. So I recommend hitting the like, subscribe and bell right now to begin engaging and not miss anything concerning this challenge. And if you're a beginner, start looking at two stocks, maybe IBM, Home Depot, Kroger. Everybody looks at Microsoft. That's why I picked IBM. If you're advanced, now's a good time to revise your watch list on picking some stocks that are stocks for tomorrow. Whatever your goal is for this challenge, let's begin. Let's begin now. Start tracking our trades and our profit levels starting one month and see if we can get this 3 to 6% net profit in order to win and improve our trading for this challenge. Everybody can do it. Repeating, we want to become a more consistent trader. Everybody, when they're doing some trading, needs to have some goals. Each trader's goals is different. They, they might have a $100 a day goal. My goal is to make this 3% to 6% every quarter consistently and trying to beat the bank. Also, every trader needs to have a trading plan where the entries, stop loss, and profit target are clearly identified. Good risk management plays a part in the tr a good trading plan. And with the, this challenge, it'd be a great opportunity to learn a new strategy or a new tool or even to get a new broker. But the main focus is to get a profit. Now, 3% on a $10,000 account is what? 300 bucks. 300 bucks in three months or $100 a month doesn't sound like that much, but it's a start. And you can go ahead and scale in as you're, you get more money or more skills. But you got to get this consistent. You got to win. You just can't start and expect to be a great trader or quit your job. You have to become consistent first. Tracking your trades, setting some goals, developing a plan, all enable you to be consistent. That's the goal. The rules for this challenge are simple. It's like just like in real life. There's lots of different traders, lots of different styles, 
there's young, there's old, there's poor, there's rich. And just like in life, those traders will trade what they're comfortable with and can trade virtually anything. The goal, again, is to get that 3% to 6%, which I try to do shoot for five, but every quarter, that's your goal. Whatever you start with, you want to get the 3 to 6% so you can trade anything. Forex, stocks, crypto, gold, Dogecoin, that's crypto. So somebody might just, uh, for, for the purposes of this challenge, take their $10,000, whatever they have to start, 20000 put it all in Dogecoin, let it ride, watch to see if somebody that's trading stocks like myself, see if they beat the, the stock market. Could happen. It's, it's happened. You can use any style, day trading, swing trading, scalping. But really, everybody is doing swing trading. You're trying to buy low and sell high. That's that's swings. And a swing trader tries to do that, capture the tops and bottoms and then the trend between. So there's a, there could be a trend trader. So any style, anytime between these dates, you start you write down how much money you're starting with, and then you write down how much you end with, and you calculate your net profit. And it, if you beat the 3%, you win. You can trade any amount of money. I'm demonstrating with a $10,000 account on Discord, and I'm showing my trades on Discord. And you can use a demo account, real account, spreadsheet, anything you want to do. Anything goes with this trade. Only point is you got to start with some money, and you end with some money. And those people that are... are been trading for some time i challenge you to go back and look at your account and see if you've done qu quarter after quarter after quarter three percent to six percent if you haven't this challenge is for you now how do you calculate the net profit you're starting out with ten thousand dollars in case of of um my demonstration i've already started trading my account and on on march 1st i'm going to note the amount of money that i have in the account at that time then I'll note the end the amount. Then I'll calculate the profit that I made. That's taking the, the end minus the beginning. Hopefully you have a positive number there. And you divide where the count is at now. And if you have 3 to 6%, you win. Any amount of money. The important thing is the start amount and the end amount. Anything goes with this challenge. But I would urge you to post your status. Tell, tell us how you're doing. Sharing with the uh, with your stocks or what what um, equity you're using, if you're using gold or silver or futures, all that stuff is interesting. And also that information I can use for other videos. So thank you. I get something out of this. What do you win with this challenge? Well, absolutely nothing. I I get that, that some benefit of comments, maybe some likes and subscribes to my videos, answering questions. Wait a minute, that makes me a better trader. So we all get something out of this. If you get your 3 to 6%, you become a better trader. You become more consistent. You will learn how to plan out your trades and create your own watch list. Come up with a simple strategy. Learn how to do technical and fundamentals. You become a more consistent trader. Now have a profitable trading system. You need to have some good stocks. So what you'll get out, you might find that you're, you're going to update your watch list based on, on the information you've given or shared or by following my strategy the stocks that I'm using. You come up with your own simple strategy. Maybe it's TTM squeeze or something else. I'm using RSI and MACD and also the stochastic RSI. You get a lot of singles. Sometimes that people use that for a trigger. And you learn about good risk management by following somebody else and see what they're doing. You could have a 50-50 system, which I trade a 50-50 system, but because I have a 20% profit target and an 8% stop loss, a 50-50 system. Do you understand? Can you see that? That I will win almost double what I lose with a 50-50 system. And the stop loss is big enough that I can let the, the stock ride a little bit because I trade options. I want the, the option, I want this trade to stay active for at least 30 days, 30 days to 45 trading days to take advantage of the option decay because I, I trade a lot of credit spreads. So I want a, a system, a strategy that gives me a good risk reward. I could, and I traded this a, a year ago, 5% and 3%, 5% and a stop loss at 3%. You get lots of trades. Your win rate goes up, way up, but you get stuck with these losers, these big losers that really eat into that profit. And you have to be, when you're using a, a profit 
and stop loss so sh small, you really have to be quick. You spend a lot of time managing your system when you have a, your stop loss so small. These bigger ones, you can kind of go on vacation. Watch it once a day. Great for swing trading. Now, a big goal for this strategy and challenge is to become a consistent and more profitable trader. What is your edge? Mine is programming. I have some experience in the market. I've learned to slow down. So I think I have somewhat of an edge. And I also learned to look at the big picture. I have a simple back-tested strategy, RSI, MACD, stochastic RSI. And I know that why I'm, I'm taking a trade, because I've done some fundamental analysis. I've looked at what the stock does at the company. So I know a little bit about the, the stock I'm trading. And I've learned to know and love my stocks. That's why I don't stop trade every stock on the market. I have a, a watch list. My strategy has a profit target, stop loss, good risk management. I look at my reports, my back test reports, my broker reports. And since I've started collaborating via the YouTube videos, my Discord chat, I've become a better trader. Now, in the next video, I'm going to go more into how I plan on winning this challenge. But basically, for this introduction to the challenge, I'm using a three indicator strategy. In other words, when the MACD, the RSI, and the stochastic RSI all give me a single, I plan on taking a trade. My trading account is starting at $10,000, and each trade will be no more than $1,200. I would trade by buying stocks and using options. I would close the trade after 45 days and start again. 45 trading days or 60 calendar days. I'm only taking long trades and the algorithm that I'm posting will give me some signals. I may or may not take them. It's up to my, my choice. So in conclusion, I want you to, to think about joining the stock market swing trading challenge for 2022. Anything goes, any style, any equity, I'm trading stocks. And the only rule is that your account must increase by three to six percent like and subscribe and follow along and join our discord chat before i end i just want to show you the discord chat out on discord the link is below and by the way the settings i'm going to use in my strategy are in the link below as well i'm using trading view and here's the three indicator strategy i'm still fixing it up i have the back test reports for my strategy and this is giving me a net profit for the last seven months of that much and my profit percentage there for those seven months are that so you take the, that and divide it by the month and multiply the number of months per quarter you got you know that's good this is very good my win rate and my loss rate if you follow along with my strategy i'm going to post the singles each day like this and with a ten thousand dollar account you run out of money taking twelve hundred dollars and currently it's the strategy says I have, I believe, six, six open positions. Bristol Myers, Broadcom. This is the ETF for consumers staples. And I'll also produce a trade list. And there they are again, the same or open, six open trades. And since, since July, trading this strategy is $3,000 profit. And on March 1st, I'll note this number and I'll see if I can increase my account from that point on by 3 to 5%, 3 to 6%. That's the challenge. And here's the stocks that I'm trading. So go out to, to the Discord chat and just get started. Start looking at what I'm posting, but also start getting your, your watch list together. Maybe start with these. Come up with a strategy. See if you're getting some singles. Come up with your plan. Well, that's all for now. Please like and subscribe. We'll catch you on the flip. Join my swing trading challenge for 2022. Happy trading. <laughs>